Hello everyone, today I have come across yet another very beautiful 48 meter span open web steel girder which is in this case is a full through steel truss and in this part of the video I would be focusing more upon the components of a top bracing connection that is uh, ensuring an integrity, integrity between the left truss and the right truss. So beside, before telling you the details of these components uh, I want to bring to your notice that this structure is located in seismic zone 4 and uh, is subjected to heavy winds because if you will see I am at the top of a mountain right now. So hence this lateral stability this structure would be subjected to heavy lateral forces and uh, uh, it has been ensured that effective lateral bracing at the top is done. So focusing on the components this first horizontal member which is connecting the two end rakers is referred to as a portal beam. This portal beam is uh, many times connected to both vertical one and as well as the end rakers but in this case it is only connected to the end raker as I will bring by a zoom section you can see these angle sections uh, this is connected to uh, this end raker and the portal beam and no connection between and no connection between the vertical V1 which is this uh, channel section with flanges facing each other is present and hence in this case only portal braces and portal beam is present. Also note that uh, in many other trusses you will see these horizontal beams spanning at all the joints, at all the joint locations, at all the gutter locations but in this case only heavy portal beams are present that to be at both ends.